This is Tara from Simple Day, and I am on a mission to make productivity simple using Monday.com. Today, I want to show you how you can hide columns and then create views out of them so you can see only the columns that you want. Here you can see I have a board of clients. This was for a accounting firm. And what they have here is first they have the names of the people linking to their accounts and some basic contact information. And then the other columns are information about who's the preparer, the reviewer, certain monthly due dates, and what services the accounting firm provides for them. So what I want to do is create two different views with hidden columns. The first one I want to create is just the contact information for everyone that would only need the contact information and doesn't need to see the rest of these columns. And the second view I want to make is everyone that needs to see these columns, what kind of services, when the next due dates are, but are not really interested in seeing the contact information. So what I would, what I do is I go under the name of the board and I click on this plus button. I click on table and I'm going to rename it to contact info. And this is going to be my first view. Then I'm going to click on this hide button and I'm just going to simply unclick on whichever columns I do not want to see. So as you see on my board, they're starting to disappear and I'm only seeing these three columns and I'm going to click save to this view. The next view that I'm going to do is just for the services. So I'm going to create a new table like I just did before, and I'm going to click hide again. And I'm going to start by clicking all of them. And then I'm going to unclick the columns that I don't want. And I'm going to click save to this view. So now if you go to the main table, you'll see that I see all of the columns. If I go to contact information, you'll see I just see the three columns I'd have to do with the contact information. And it even tells me here how many are hidden. And if I go to the service view, you'll see I'll just see the services and it'll tell me how many are hidden here. You can very easily check or uncheck more columns that you want to add or take away from your views. Just make sure that you click on the same save to item view after you do it so that way it actually saves. Thanks for joining me. And if you enjoyed this video, hit the like button below. Make sure to subscribe if you want to see more videos on how to unleash the power of Monday.com. Thanks again for watching and until next time.